All right, Bucks fever now. Fresh off the Bucks thrilling game one win over Toronto, a Northside restaurant is getting some national attention. Ben Jordan spent the day at Mr. Perkins with dozens of fans anxiously awaiting the arrival of TNT analyst, NBA great, and Chitlin lover, Charles Barkley. Well, it's safe to say those who spent several hours here this morning in hopes of meeting Sir Charles and Shaq left sorely disappointed as they never showed. But there is always tomorrow. Inside Mr. Perkins restaurant on Milwaukee's north side, Hello. seats are full with Bucks fans after more than just soul food. I'm waiting on Shaq. Charles Barkley. Charles Barkley gave a shout out to the restaurant during a TNT post game show last night. I went to my favorite soul food place today, Perkins. <laughs> I had my chillings. Shaq is going tomorrow. But as morning turned to afternoon with no one in the restaurant taller than six feet, Lucinda Grant's trip fell short of her hope for an embrace with the two jokesters. Are you a little disappointed that they aren't here yet? Yes, I am. <laughs> what did you want to say to, to Shaq or Sir Charles? Can I just have a hug? Damon Turner wasn't too bummed as he got to meet Barkley here yesterday. I was elated. I mean, just smiles. Everybody was just smiles all in the place. They even snapped a pic for evidence. He was nice, very pleasant, talked to everyone, greeted everybody. It was huge. As closing time came without the two big men, Mr. Perkins owner Cherry Perkins is simply thankful for the national attention. It's exciting. It's humbling. I mean, it's good to know that customers that have been a part of the history of Mr. Perkins and Mr. Barkley has frequent our restaurant for many, many years as an NBA player. With Without a shack showing, Dwayne Morgan gave us his best impression. I plan on eating the chitlins, plan on eating some fried chicken, get me a little uh, cornbread in there. The owner here at Mr. Perkins tells me she has no insider knowledge of any celebrities stopping by tomorrow, but she remains hopeful as well. On Milwaukee's north side, Ben Jordan, today's TMJ4.